Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Jordan Beck and behind the camera is my wife, Alaitra Beck. And together we are Around the World of Beck. We post new videos weekly, sometimes us exploring Europe and some travel vlogging, as well as our life here in the UK. Today's video is going to be a comparison video about the UK's Lake and Heath BX and Mildenhall BX. So if this sort of thing interests you, hit that subscribe button down below and we'll post more videos in the future. The BX is basically a shortened version for base exchange where they offer a variety of different goods, a lot of them being American goods, and we're gonna bring to you what to expect inside. We're starting off at the side entrance of the BX. It's kind of a giant T shape. So we're starting at the base of this T where you'll find behind me the barber shop, the restrooms, uh, some food selections for the food court and medical supplies. Not too far from the side entrance of the T, you'll find a couple of more restaurants or at least the main restaurants of the BX, which is going to be Charlie's, Pizza Hut, and a Dunkin' Donuts that also sells Ben & Jerry's. It's kind of tucked away in the corner, but there is a good space to Go and eat your lunch as well as a soda fountain so that you can refill as you're enjoying lunch. But there's still more restaurants and more places to eat right around the corner. And this part of the BX is the most busy. And partially that's because this is where the Starbucks is and where the new highly anticipated Annie Ann's open in the winter of this past year. Before we check out the main shopping area of the BX, there's another portion that you might miss. It's kind of the top of the T, where you'll find the Bath and Body Shack, the flower store, a really big toy store that kind of has some local games and American style games. You have the military auto source, where in case you're interested in purchasing an American vehicle, they can help arrange that for you. And then lastly, the ITT shop where you can find some unique travel events going on in the area or even ones that they arrange for close international travel. And this is the main shopping area of the VX where you can find a variety of different things and all of these things are gonna be tax free. So that's good if you need last minute gift shopping or stocking up for the holidays. There's things here from clothes to electronics to candy and all sorts of variety of things that you wouldn't normally find in the commissary. If you guys want to see our take and preview of the commissary, let us know down in the comments below. So this is the part of the area that I'm most fascinated with as it has all the technology, computer parts, it's got monitors, it's got video games, it's got all this stuff. The best part is it's usually a little on sale and is tax free, which is a huge benefit for people that like to buy those expensive technologies. They even have an Apple representative over there that can answer some questions for you and help you with the purchases, which I think is a much added benefit as being able to buy Apple products here is kind of confusing. For those Bath & Body Works fans out there, this is gonna be huge because Bath & Body Works is not available here in the UK. So really you can only get it here. And this is the very limited selection that they have. They actually just added this section over here. So uh, for those of you that need to stock up before you come here, I would advise to do so as it is a limited selection. They also have plenty of makeup and handbags and I guess Vera Bradley, if you're interested. They also have high-end items here. In case anybody wants them, they have Michael Coors and coach purses, which do range at the normal price tag, but luckily that tax free is gonna help you out. On to the next part of the store. The BX offers a wide variety of clothing from men's clothing, women's clothing, infant's clothing, and children's clothing. Another thing to note too, for those of you that are curious, there is a spot in the back of the store to get some nice suits and some nice business wear that can also be tailored. Within these aisles, you'll find a hodgepodge of household goods or just things to get you by. And for the electronic portions of things, it's important to note that there's actually gonna be a distinguish between European UK voltage at 220 and US voltage at 110. 
And while one aisle may hold electric appliances or trash bins, other ones might hold cups and plates. This might be useful for those of you that are moving here with little to nothing. And speaking of little to nothing, when you come over here, you may not have a long-term supply of essentials that you need as you're waiting for your house. So they have shampoo and shavers and all sorts of things that can help you get by. This wraps up our tour of Lake and Heath's BX. Now let's head over to Milton Hall BX. After a short 10 minute drive, you can arrive at the Milton Hall BX, where you will find things that complement the Lake and Heath BX. And it's kind of the same size and shape, at least uh, for the most part. So you have a long hallway here that has the same kind of like mobile center, gift shops, has a barber shop as well. But behind me, you'll see a smaller food court that has some differences, like it has a BK and a Taco Bell. Uh, interestingly enough, while both of them have a Pizza Hut, I think personally that the wings here at this Pizza Hut are much better. So if you're a wing fan and miss that sort of style from home, this is the place to go. And then just over there is the main shopping center that uh, has a variety of different things and is different from the Lake and Heath one in the sense that the gas station is con is connected to the main shopping area. So let's go ahead and check that out and show you what we're talking about. So here you can see the gas station portion of the shop. There's plenty of things for food and quick little snacks to continue your day. Right now, the Milton Hall petrol station is under construction. So you can't really fill up here. You have to go to Lake and Heath to fill up your vehicle, but they're going to be opening it very soon with improved pumps and more spots to fill up the car. So it's gonna be very busy here shortly. But as you can see, plenty of snacks, plenty of places to get the things that you need for the day. And it's conveniently located right next to Melbourne Hall's main BX. I think one of the biggest differences between the Lake and Heath BX and the Milden Hall BX is that the Milden Hall BX has a lot of furniture on display that you can purchase. They have things from couches to chairs, dining room sets, office sets, uh, even bedrooms. They have mattresses. So for those that are expanding their family or simply moved over here with nothing, maybe they were worried about the different sizes. Once you moved in, you discovered you do have room for that king size mattress. You can come here and take a look. And from what I understand, if they don't have any show pieces out that you like, you can work with this BX to try and ship something from their catalog here, and then you can arrange for pickup later. Uniquely, Milton Hall also has a large toy section, everything from just outdoor crafts and matchbox sort of collections. You can pretty much find everything you need here for your kids. Just a wide variety and the, probably one of the better places to Christmas shop as well. The BX also has appliances like washers and deep freezes, as well as refrigerator in case you want some extra ones. Usually the base will provide washers and dryers, but you may need extra fridges for more food depending on your family. Speaking of family, they have plenty of stuff here for little ones like cribs and dressers and stuff to accommodate for your expanding family. In case you need it, you can also purchase different car seats here. But what's interesting is you can review the US spec car car seats, as well as ones that are UK. It might be helpful for those that are visual learners and confused with all the regulations online. There also happens to be a large outdoor activity section for Milton Hall, including bikes, just workout gear, there's treadmills, resistant bands, all sorts of things that you can use for your home gym and improvement. And Milton Hall seems to be the place to get those. And that pretty much concludes our comparison of the Lake and Heath BX and the Milden Hall BX. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. And if you wanna see more like these, comparing the different bases or just general information about them, let us know in the comments down below. We love filming these kind of videos and helping you guys out in your journey to also come to England. And if you wanna see more Americans try, we have a playlist down below that kind of reviews the things to expect here in England and just our reactions. So thanks again so much for joining us and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.